Some hardcore fans know him as Big Sabi, but most people recognise him as Marcel Sabitzer. For those of you who don't know, Marcel will now play for Manchester United until the end of 2023. In this video, we will talk about some of the crazy aspects of the talented player's life, from his impact on Leipzig to how much money he earned so far and his love life. These are the 10 things you probably didn't know about Marcel Sabitzer. Number 10. Marcel Sabitzer was born for football and he started to notice this from a young age, all thanks to his dad who was his coach and mentor. By the time Marcel was 5 years old, he had already grasped the essentials of the sport, from the physics of movement to the spatial awareness required for top level play. His dad also set him on the path to greatness, enrolling him at Admira Villach for his first taste of competitive football. Marcel played for Admira from 2000 to 2001 before moving on to Grazia AK for a seven year stint that saw him develop into the footballer he is today. With a coach and mentor like his dad, it's no wonder Marcel is playing in one of the best teams in the world. Number 9 His old clubs would never forget him. Subitza has left a lasting impression on Leipzig, becoming one of the club's standout players during its transformation into a Bundesliga title contender and a regular in the UEFA Champions League. To be honest, I never thought I'd be a single season for RB Leipzig, but things took a surprisingly positive turn. Subitza said, reflecting on his 145 Bundesliga appearances with the club before joining Bayern. However, things weren't always so cosy and rosy for Sabitzer. After spending his first year with Leipzig at Salzburg, he questioned his decision to join the up-and-coming German club. I thought to myself, I must not be as good as I thought I was if I'm playing in the Bundesliga 2 in Germany, he recalled. Now, Marcel has everything to make history in a club like Manchester United. Do you think he will be remembered as one of the stars of this team? Number 8 He can do it all coaches are now treasure hunting for versatility, and Sabitzer is like a Swiss army knife on the football field. He's the kind of player that brings a constant level of awesomeness to the game, with moments of brilliance that will leave you speechless. Gush is Nagelsmann. He's the backbone of any team, always delivering solid performance after solid performance. René Mullenstein, the former coach of Manchester United, has applauded the club's Swiss response to securing Marcel Sabitzer on loan after Christian Eriksen was ruled out for three months. As a former coach at the club, he worked there between 2001 and 2013. Mühlenstein believes Sabitzer has the potential to fill the gap left by the Danish midfielder. He stated, I think it's a very smart and rapid reaction from Manchester United. I'm a huge admirer of Christian Eriksen, he's a fantastic player and one of the few who connects the build-up play to the attack. Number 7 Losing? No way, not for Sabitzer. He hates it more than traffic jams and taxes combined, chuckles Holchester. Back in the day, losing in even a practice game was a heart-wrenching experience for him. But hey, a hatred for losing is a good thing, right? Added former Leipzig coach Ralf Ragnick with a smile. The only downside was that Sabi used to get a little too intense about it. Listen, I never heard of any ill intentions, said Sabitza with a shrug. I just wanted to win, that's all. Maybe I broke a few things and got a little loud and aggressive, but it wasn't personal. It was just my way of showing my commitment to the cause and my burning desire to win. Number 6 His mindset is everything. Subitza is all about being focused and single-minded in his professional life, and that extends to his physical preparation as well. He wants to look back on a fantastic career with top clubs and great success, so he focuses on what he can control – his performance. To maintain that level of performance, Sabitzer follows a strict routine. He's in bed by 10pm, hasn't touched a crisp in over 5 years, and keeps himself in top shape. It's paid off. He missed only 6 league matches due to injury in his Bundesliga seasons, which is quite an accomplishment for someone who's often in the thick of the midfield battle. I don't mind playing 90 minutes every third day as long as I can stick to my rhythm, Sabitzer says. Number 5 Marcel Sabitzer made a swift and decisive move to join Manchester United on loan from Bayern Munich in the dramatic transfer deadline day dash. Sabitzer was eager to take on this new opportunity, had to act quickly as the deadline had loomed. He boarded a flight from Germany to Manchester and arrived at Carrington, the training ground of Manchester United, where he underwent a medical and finalised the terms of his loan move. Despite the tight time constraints, Sabitzer was able to complete all necessary steps and submit the deal sheet just before the 11pm deadline, ensuring that his move was confirmed and rubber stamped. 
the competitive player is eager to contribute to Manchester United's aims and goals this season, stating, Sometimes in life, you have to make quick and important decisions. From the moment I heard about this opportunity, I knew it was right for me. Number 4. Marcel Sabitzer's love life is a topic that has garnered much interest from fans who have been following the player's rise to fame in Europe. With his talent and success on the field, many have wondered about his relationship status, asking questions like, who is Marcel Sabitzer's girlfriend, or is he married? The answer to these questions is that Marcel Sabitzer is in a long-term relationship with his girlfriend, Katia Kuhn. The two met before 2016 and have been inseparable ever since. Their relationship is widely regarded as one of the strongest in German football. Before their relationship, Katia was an actress and reality TV star, having won the RTL show Der Bachelor in 2014. Since then, she had become the mainstay in Marcel's life, and the two are currently engaged with plans for marriage shortly. Katia has shown her love for Marcel by becoming a mother to their daughter, Mary Lou, who was born in 2019. This only solidifies the strong bond they share and their commitment to one another. In conclusion, Marcel Sabitzer's love life is a testament to the power of true love and the impact that it can have on an individual's life. His relationship with Katia has not only brought him immense joy and happiness, but it has also given him a family that he can cherish for a lifetime. Number 3. Marcel Sabitzer is living a high life with a net worth of 20 million euros and a reputation as one of the hottest prospects in the world of football. The winter window of the 2022-2023 season saw him make a move to Manchester United, leaving Bayern Munich behind, at least for now. With an annual salary of 8.5 million euros, Marcel is raking in a whopping 165k euros each week. The big question on everyone's mind is who will be picking up the bill for all this? Will it be his old club Bayern Munich, as he's still under contract with them, or will Manchester United be taking care of the business? This answer remains a mystery for now. Number 2 Sabitzer's luscious locks are the envy of many, but he's not afraid to mess with his teammates' hairdos. It's something that's probably experienced when Nagelsmann made Sabitzer the captain of Leipzig during the 2020-2021 season. I'm not a drill sergeant, I like to sit back and watch the game unfold, Sabitzer said of his captaincy style, but if someone needs a little push or reminder to keep their cool, I'm not afraid to step in. Sabitzer values honesty above all else, and he's not afraid to tell his teammates the truth to their faces as long as they can handle the same from him. And number one. Marcel Sabitzer is a leader on the field, but this doesn't mean he's not open to some good old-fashioned constructive criticism. The rest of the squad will soon find out that Marcel can be quite the chatterbox, but he's also more than willing to listen when it's his performance that is called out. I had to learn to take advice from others even when I didn't want to hear it. Marcel said with a chuckle. This was a time when I was 16 or 17, and I thought I had it all figured out. But the truth is, I hadn't accomplished anything yet. The only way to improve is by embracing constructive criticism. What do you think about Marcel's career so far? Is he destined to become a United great like Wayne Rooney or Cristiano Ronaldo? Drop your thoughts in the comment section below.